I'm Miss Nikki, and welcome back to my channel, Miss Nikki Loves the Kids. If you're ready to read a bedtime story, stay tuned. But before we get into that bedtime story, find that red little button that says subscribe and hit it. And don't forget to click the bell so you'll get notifications every time I post a new story. If you're ready, follow me also on Instagram at Miss Nikki Loves the Kids. And if you're ready, and me and Mickey are definitely ready, stay tuned. Listen for the chime to know when to turn the page. The name of this story is called Hair Love by Matthew A. Cherry, illustrated by Vashti Harrison. My name is Zuri, and I have hair that has a mind of its own. It kinks, coils, and curls every which away. Daddy tells me it is beautiful. That makes me proud. I love that my hair lets me be me. In funky braids with beads, I am a princess. And when my hair is in two puffs, I am above the clouds like a superhero. My hair even does magic tricks. One day, Rocky and I were playing outside when along came the rain. From large to small it went. Presto, just like that. There is nothing my hair can't do. Today, I woke up extremely early all by myself. I was too excited to sleep. It's a big day. Daddy was still sleeping. Shh. I said to Rocky as we tiptoed past him. Lately, Daddy has been worn out. He makes me breakfast, takes me to school, goes to work, picks me up, and yesterday we went for a bike ride around the park. I think he needs a break. Because today is special. I want a perfect hairstyle. This calls for a professional's touch. Paws off, Rocky. Daddy heard the crash. Zuri, what on earth, he asked. I was only trying to help, I said. Daddy smiled. Can I help too? It'll be a piece of cake, Zuri. The first style was a big no way. Oh my goodness, look at that. Do you guys like that hairstyle? I think it's pretty cute. The second was no better. No, daddy. Oh, how do you think that makes her feel? Does she like her hair? No, she doesn't really like this style. Let's see the next one. Then daddy tried sticking my hair back into Putu Pup. Ouch, daddy yelled. Uh-oh, what happened? A rubber band popped daddy in the eye. Oh my goodness, say be careful. Wait a minute, Daddy, said as he reached into the drawer and pulled out a pick. Ta-da! Daddy, really? I said, I'll be right back, you promise. Now how's that, he asked, pulling a hat down over my eyes. What color is her hat? Yes, it's red with a pink bow on top. Daddy, come on, we can do better than that. I really need my hair to be special. Don't worry, he said, we'll figure this out. Then I had a great idea. Daddy gathered all the tools we needed and we were set. Let's see, they got their iPad, to watch a YouTube video probably, a brush, a pick, a wide tooth comb, and looks like some leave-in conditioner. Watching carefully, Daddy combed, parted, oiled, and twisted. 
He nailed it. Funky puff buns. Pretty, pretty, and so much fun. Rocky approved, too. I put on my superhero cape as the final touch to a perfect look. Where is my Zuzu? Mommy called from the door. She could not get in the house fast enough. Mommy! You've got to be the prettiest Supergirl I have ever seen, she said. And your hair is beautiful, Zuri. Who did it? I looked at Daddy and Bean. Mommy smiled. Very nice. Thank you. We learned from the best. Daddy said as he gave her a big hug. My hair is Mommy, Daddy, and me. It's hair love. I sure did. And if you enjoyed that story, please remember to subscribe to my channel, Miss Nikki Loves the Kids. And also follow me on Instagram at Miss Nikki Loves the Kids. And I'm going to post videos and stories probably every week, maybe two a week. And if you like these videos, just continue to watch my channel and watch it grow. And I thank you so much for your support. Bye. Good night.